Unlock the thrilling speed potential of your Xiaomi One S electric scooter. Ready to take your Xiaomi One S electric scooter to the next level? Buckle up, because I am about to reveal not one, but two exhilarating ways to supercharge your ride and hit speeds of up to 30 km per hour. But before we dive in, let's talk real talk. This isn't your average throw in the park. We are diving into the world of scooter patching, where risks and rewards go hand in hand. If you are ready to embrace the adrenaline, then let's roll. Picture this. Cruising effortlessly at 27 km per hour, solid tires hugging in the road, your weight is a mere 80 kilos. This is where the magic begins. I'm going to walk you through a step-by-step -step journey to elevate your Xiaomi One S model's performance. A word of caution though. Patching is a thrill ride with its own set of bumps. It's not for the faint-hearted. Just remember, we are focusing solely on the Xiaomi One S. No shortcuts here, folks. First things first. We are diving into the world of tech. Ready? Open up the G app on your trusty Android phone. Your scooter is about to become your best friend, as we are getting cozy via Bluetooth. And yes, it will ask for a little power button romance, just a confirmation dance. Here comes the fun part, the open bin button. It's like the key to your scooter's inner secrets. You've got the choices and I'm here to guide you through. Links to the magic zip files are nestled in the description, waiting to elevate your journey. Patching time. I'm eyeing a speed bump at the 30 km per hour barrier. But remember, patience is key, around a minute of suspense, so don't hit that panning button. No distractions allowed, no calls, no phone playtime. This is your scooter's grand transformation moment. Guess what? We are ready to roll. A reboot, a restart, and there it is, 30 km per hour glowing on that display. Though, I must admit, real world results vary. I'm getting a solid 27 km per hour on those flat surfaces. But oh, the thrill of knowing the potential is unlocked. But wait, there is more. I've got another trick up my sleeve. Turbo mode. Brace yourselves, because now your scooter is going full beast mode. Acceleration that leaves you grinning and a start that feels like rocket launch. It's more than a ride, it's an experience. Applying this turbo boost is a breeze, just a download away. I'm guiding you through a dance of transformation. And in order to start the scooter in turbo mode, you will have to press the brake lever and only then to turn on the scooter, as I show it on the video. This will enable turbo mode. When it's all said and done, a simple dance with the brake lever before power up and voila, turbo time. It's not just about the numbers, it's about feeling of raw power. Now here is a twist. What if you crave a little nostalgia? Fear not, I've got a safety net. Reverting to the original software is a piece of cake. That's right, a zip file for nostalgia's sake. I'm showcasing this reset, ensuring you are always in control. And remember the tech tango earlier? Well, there is a small hiccup. Some phones play hard to get with our zip files. There is a possibility that once you download the zip file, it will not be selectable by application. File is grayed out. But worry not, a little file naming magic and you are back in the game. In order to make the file accessible or selectable, just open the file manager, navigate to the downloaded file and modify its name as I show it. Then navigate back to the downG application and this file should be selectable. It's like giving your phone a secret handshake, easy peasy. As we wrap up this electrifying journey, my friends, I have to say thank you. Your thumbs up is our fuel and your excitement keeps us riding high. Until next time, keep those wheels spinning and let's make the road our playground.